Roger Sprague and Fred Crow were jaw by jaw at the crucial 50 franc point when Roger pulled suddenly ahead, downing two dogs at a time until he broke the record of. It's too much copy. Eden Castillo. Oh, that bad, huh? Oh, it's so nice to hear your voice. Say something meaningful to me. <laughs> I love you. What's going on? Well, every job has its trivial sides, right? I mean, you can't deal with big issues all the time. We have to lighten up. Oh, no, they've got her in the dog catcher beat. Worse. I mean, they need this tape right away. I have no idea what I'm doing. You don't know what follow-up copy is, do you? No, I'm sorry, I don't. Oh. Well, how about with you? Well, I'm off to a slow start. Keith has given me the runaround. Well, that doesn't seem too slow. Well, you're right in the middle of the fire with that one. Oh, I gotta go. Okay. I uh, love you. Bye. Try to keep personal phone calls to a minimum, Miss Capwell. That was my first one. You finished editing that final piece yet? Well, kind of, but you see, I have a question. You should have asked it before. There is no time now. One oh. of the things you will learn in this business, Miss Capwell, assuming you are in it that long, is that deadlines are the bottom line. Undoubtedly, you're used to a somewhat uh, slower pace over at Capwell Enterprises. But here, the important thing is speed. Speed and uh, accuracy, of course. I'm going to have to give this to somebody else to finish it up. Well, don't look too disappointed, Miss Capwell. You'll get the hang of things eventually, I'm sure. Castillo. Thank you.